Welcome back to the new video in Excel ChatGPT. Here we'll understand how to generate a sample data for Excel using this ChatGPT option. Now, if you're an aspiring data analyst or if you're an instructor or a teacher or a person who works with the data day and night, now this is something for you. Now, usually to create some dummy data because we want to practice on creating reports and dashboards or we want to practice about the SQL, it takes a lot of time. Searching on internet takes a lot of time and you don't get the right relevant data which you want. Using ChatGPT, you can demand that the type of data you want, the data types you want from this particular tool. Let's try to understand. So I'll ask them three questions, not more than that. You'll get an understanding about how to get the answers. So first question I have is, I'm using the version named as 3.5. I also have a version which is ChatGPT4, which is a paid premium version. I will also show you the topic. So first question I have, create a dummy employee data set for practice purpose. So I'll just press enter. What I'll do is, it will create a data into a CSV format. Okay, so I can just copy the data from here, go to the Excel, and I can just paste the data in some other location, maybe here. I can go to the other sheet, Control V. Now this data, I have got it here, and I can just copy paste and I can do some changes over here. However, if I want to ask them some other questions, okay, now this was about just 10 records. I can demand that uh, create minimum 100 records okay so you can ask them create minimum 100 records it will obey the orders what you give him you can also tell them create 30 40 50 100 columns it will still do it you tell them the data should be interesting the data should not be john phillips and all these are very boring data set so i can tell them data should have right now now see my demand when i'm training someone i have to make it little interesting so the question here is the data should be of the famous characters which are available on the Netflix and Amazon and those data sets should be from mostly from India because when you tell people about John, Phillips and Mike, they don't get interested. But now when I ask them, uh, make it little fun, little interesting for my learners. Now if you see the data which I have got will have the Indian touch, will have the Netflix characters and all. So when I open this, when I copy this data, okay, let me copy this data from here. It's creating 100 records. So let me, yes. So I can just copy the data, come back to Excel, and here I can just paste the data. So let's understand the data sets. So first, let me split the data in text to columns. And the delimiter right now, delimiter for this data set here is, I can click on next. It's a comma and click on finish. So what are the character names? Let me just zoom the screen for you. It says Raj Malhotra, Simran Singh, Vijay Sharma, Pooja, Kabir Bedi, Kabir Singh, Sultan Ali Khan. This is the name of the character here. Bobby Dewal, Dev and so on. This one, Raju Rastokian, Faran Qureshi. These are some famous names you might know. So, to make the learning more interesting rather than John, Mike and Phillips, you can ask GPT, give me the right interesting characters of movies, of games, on people and so on. That is one part. Now, what I can do is, I can ask them some advanced question here, control C. So, please observe, I'll create a new chat and I can go to chat GPT-4 and that's a code interpreter. Now, code interpreter is an add-in which is freely available for the premium users. GPT-4 cost $20 per user per month. So, I'll go for code interpreter. Now, the question which I'm asking them is, I'm a student who wants to practice data on Power BI and need data set on HR domain create 10 columns 100 rows of employee information data should have inconsistency and i should have a scope of cleaning the data first before analyzing now this is something which is a real time case study everyone where i want to clean the data first then i want to go for data visualization keep the data for the indian market related and download the data in excel format so it is so smart this activity took me around four hours to actually create data and my people used to take two to three days but using this chat GPT in less than 120 seconds, depending upon the speed what you have right now, less than 120 seconds, this data will be created in Excel and you can just download that link directly and use it for your learning purpose. This was time consuming. I used to take four hours. There are many people who used to take days together to get the right answers. I have got the data for employee, HR employee. You can get data for Netflix, Amazon, cricket, volleyball, politics weather conditions, Uber, Ola, Domino's, Flipkart, anything. So you can choose what exactly which domain you want to work and you can pick up that. As an aspiring data analyst, you get that data, 
do the project put into your resume this is a project done on dummy data set so if you observe here the data has been created successfully here are the first few rows which is okay now it is trying to give me some data set this is the data which is priyansh but amira bhatnagar amani auwalia and so on and here it says as you see the data contains inconsistency and missing values which is what i want right i don't want the learners to get the clean data and start creating just visuals many people think i can just click on download many people think that just creating column charts and pie chart makes you a data analyst no a proper data analyst will know everything okay most of the things a person will know so if you observe here this is the data set which i have carefully observe this data set contains inconsistency which have some blank records okay if you see there's some blank cells as well some places you might find some uh, spaces unwanted data date formats and so on so if the data is not up to the mark you can again request them to get the right answers and right data set this is how you can get the answers from chat gpt4 the latest version which is a paid and premium version now this is just a start i've just given three questions you as a person can ask them many questions get the maximum output usage of this tool it is not going to take away of jobs it is definitely going to boost the jobs of those people who are more creative more hard working it is a support system but there are some people who are just doing a redundant and repetitive work that is something which are in danger right now but use this tool to support your work and make your work faster so i hope you have understood how to generate the sample data from chat gpt and that's all for this video